I'm Rob O'Toole with the Orange County Register and welcome to OCN2 for Wednesday, January 14th. The Angels will get no more fight from Anaheim over restoring the ball club's name to the Anaheim Angels. Anaheim Mayor Kurt Pringle announced at the end of last night's meeting that council members voted unanimously in closed session not to spend more money fighting the name change in court. The city sued the team after owner Artie Moreno changed the name to the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim in 2005, claiming the team had violated the city-owned stadium lease agreement, which required that the team name include Anaheim. An Orange County Superior Court jury ruled in the Angels' favor in 2006, and a 4th District Court of Appeal upheld that ruling last month. A Yorba Linda father and son were killed in a plane crash near Steamboat Springs, Colorado. 54-year-old Bill Rooney and his 26-year-old son Patrick were returning home Sunday morning when their single-engine private plane went down. The men had originally planned to leave Steamboat Springs on Saturday but changed their plans, deciding to wait another day after learning about the strong Santa Ana winds near Chino Hills, where the pair intended to land. Bill's wife, Debbie Rooney, said the crash is all the more shocking because Bill was a very cautious man. The crash is under investigation, but it appears the plane attempted to return to the airport before crashing in a field two miles north of the runway. Bill Rooney had seven years of flying experience. All 4,218 county social service workers will get an extra two weeks off this year, whether they want it or not, and they won't be paid for the extra vacation. Yesterday, Orange County supervisors approved the furlough as part of the county's efforts to trim $32 million from the current fiscal year's budget, necessitated by a shrinking outlay from Sacramento. A former Orange County Police Department veteran pleaded guilty to secretly taking sexually suggestive photographs of young girls at the 2007 Garden Grove Strawberry Festival. 55-year-old Ralph Lakin of La Palma was convicted of eight misdemeanor counts of secretly photographing underage girls for sexual gratification. Witnesses spotted Lakin shooting the photos of young girls he didn't know. Lakin was sentenced to four years probation, 100 hours community service, and ordered to register as a sex offender. Pacific Coast Shark News, a website that monitors and publishes reports of shark activity along the West Coast, has posted a report of a possible Great White sighting January 8th in the ocean off San Clemente. San Clemente City Hall issued a press release calling the report unconfirmed, but Richard Thornton, the local resident in the report, told the register that he indeed saw a large shark that may have been up to 15 feet long, adding that someone initially thought it was a baby gray whale until it lifted its head out of the water. City Hall said it's important to note that San Clemente lifeguards have never sighted a great white shark at any San Clemente beaches. And you can read more about all of these stories and get your breaking news all day at ocregister.com.